Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to kill Lich King on Heroic 25 man. The fight's been really dumbed down since the Legacy Rage patch, but there are still a few mechanics that can kill you. So I'm going to be telling you how to deal with each of them. For the first phase, you are going to want to pop all your cooldowns just to push him into the second phase as fast as possible. He will cast Infest on you, which shouldn't be a problem for most classes. And it's nowhere near as what it was before because it only deals damage to you if you have less than 90% HP. He's also going to cast Shadow Trap on you, which you have to move out of because if you stand on it, you're going to get blown off the platform and that's just instant death. Now the adds shouldn't be a problem, you can probably one or two shot them. And the Shambling Horror you're going to want to pick up right away, start dealing damage to him. And once you push Lich King in the second phase, he's going to start casting his AoE Ice, which doesn't do any damage anymore. So if you are ranged, you can probably stay on him and just kill the Ice Spheres. When they come out, but for melee, I like to come to these stairs because if an ice sphere does hit you, you know you might not notice it. You will not get blown off the platform. You'll just get blown up the stairs a little bit. So this phase is pretty easy. The raging spirits do deal a little bit of damage because they do have a stacking debuff as well. But for the most part, you should be fine. So make sure to just keep killing all the raging spirits. Don't get hit by any of the ice spheres, and I'll be coming back once the next phase starts. Now once the second phase is over, you're going to want to run in and just kill any remaining ice spheres that are left so you don't get blown off. And just pop all your cooldowns again and keep DPSing him. This fight's really easy after the patch, so there's not much to worry about. Just make sure you're above 90% for infest, so that way it doesn't deal as much damage. Valkyries you don't have to worry about because when you're solo, they can't pick you up. If you are with another person, they should go down in one or two hits. I'm not sure I haven't got them, but according to all the other monsters, that's how it should be. And you're going to push him back into his ice phase again, and just run back to the stairs and do it all over. Now right here I do get lucky because I have my judgment as a mouse over macro and I accidentally hit Lich King. But as the Ice Sphere blew me off, he did pull me into Frostborn. So that just goes to show that you do need to be careful when you're running in because those Ice Spheres can kill you if you don't get as lucky as I did. Now this phase is the most damage intensive. I don't know exactly what it is because I haven't really looked it up, but this one does hit me for quite a bit so if you aren't in a class that can heal you might have a little trouble on this one but this phase you just gotta kill all the raging spirits that come down and hit you and blow up Once you're out, he has a couple new abilities. One of them is Defile. Then one you just want to get out of so you're not as stressed because it does deal a little bit of damage. And these Vile Spirits, you can just ignore these. They won't deal any damage to you after the patch. And this is just a push for the kill. It's really that simple.
And there it is, once you push him to 10%, he will go into his little RP mode. I don't think it kills you anymore, because every time I do this, I don't die. And you can just DPS him through this phase, get him to 1 HP, and about 30 seconds left on the RP, you can't actually kill him. So that's it for this video. I hope it helped anyone that had any trouble. And it's super easy after the patch. But besides that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like. Make sure to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time. Yo!